being joined uh, by a team of panelists at this point. Dinakar Lanka, who's a BJP Sham, uh, who's a who's from the BJP. Sham Prasad Mehta, who's a political analyst, as well as Suresh Kochitil, who's a senior journalist. Thank you very much, all three of you, for joining us. At this point, if I may, uh, first come across go, uh, go across to Sham Prasad Mehta. Mr. Sham Pr Prasad Mehta, what's happening? Is the heat getting on to leaders, or is it just the VIP culture mindset that's catching up? Um, see, uh, okay. First of all, let me clarify. Uh, I'm a Congress leader. Okay, you, uh, though I can I can do a lot of political analysis. <laughs> okay, now on this issue, irrespective of the party. Thank you, sir. Thank you for correcting us involved. on that. Yeah, uh, that's fine. Uh, irrespective of the parties that are involved or incidents, I think this this arrogance of political leaders has seeped in very deep in every party, but. In certain circumstances, oh yeah, they'll come up with excuses. Oh, I was uh, in the heat of the moment, or the the victim did something wrong. Okay, fine. You you guys are leaders. Who gave you the right to do that? Who gave the right to that MLA in Tenali in Andhra Pradesh to slap That's that guy? That's what people are asking. Who gives them the right? Did wh what did you do to that Congress candidate's brother? I mean, was any action taken? They come from a very strong political family, so that mindset could have been very well embedded. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's it's Congress, YC, YSRCP, or it's BJP, RJD. That is the culture. The same leaders know. In, today they might be in this party, tomorrow they are in that party. Doesn't make a difference. They they are arrogant that they can appropriate the power to themselves through whatever means by switching the parties. But ultimately, the power will be in the, in only these hands. So they become arrogant and that should not be accepted. For that matter, those MLA uh, supporters, when they were thrashing the voter, I, I think uh, the, the remaining voters should have rebelled, should have stopped it. See, we, we have become too subservient. We, we, we normal people are in a way accepting their arrogance. And I think this needs to change irrespective of parties and political narratives uh, coming and soft peddling some things, talking nonsense. I think we need to stop all this. Dinakar Lanka? Dinakar Lanka, your responses to what you've heard from Shama Prasad Mehta that this runs across party lines, including BJP. Can I respond? Yes, please. I'm, I'm not getting audio. Mr. Dinakar Lanka, if you can hear us. Yeah. Your no. Congress counterpart claims that this mindset runs across parties. It is specific it is. to particular leaders, including we, those in BJP. It, it, we can't generalize this issue. This is election day. It is the festival of democracy. On this day, the arrogance which comes out from the leaders uh, shall, not, shall not be generalized. As far as uh, the incident from Guntur parliamentary constituency, Tenali assembly constituency, existing sitting MLA, Shivakumar, he is contesting on behalf of YSRCP. His arrogance, he obstructed as the citizen. He infringed the rights of the fundamental rights of the, the citizen. Uh, the person who want to cast his vote he, to exercise his right, uh, he, 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 he was in queue today morning in uh, Tenali Assembly Constituency. He rushed this, uh, Shivakumar rushed, and uh, first uh, he was slapped on the face of uh, uh, common men who want to cast his vote. Uh, uh, rudely, the, the way in which the behavior which happened uh, uh, um, from the uh, sitting MLA, it is uh, condemnable. And this kind of attitude, arrogance, uh, is prevailing in the state of Andhra Pradesh for the last five years. Today, today is one incident. It, it, it has been showcasing the um, uh, intolerance of the YSRCP because NDA is going to register landslide victory. They are unable to digest right from the beginning today, from morning to till evening. Across the state, we had seen so many 
such kind of uh, attacks against even the uh, superintendent of police got attacked against, uh, by the ruling YSR CP a, a sitting MLA from Dadi Patri constituency. We have seen that um, uh, uh, MP candidate from Guntur uh, Kilaru Rosia who brutally attacked on uh, SC okay. Angboy. All right. And uh, in same no, Guntur. You,